we have the MNN 15.6 inch portable monitor here. This will be a quick live real unboxing plus review. This is what you'll be getting if you order it. Kind of looks like an Apple product. Really cool. Nice design here on the side. Portable monitor. More information will be below in the description box. So what is included? Portable monitor, smart cover, power adapter, USB-C data cable, USB-A to C cable, mini HDMI to HDMI cable, and the user manual. This is a 1080p model, which is uh, the best value. I'm using this for work, giving more space to my MacBook for extra screen real estate. And I'm hoping that this will help you guys to decide to find a quality portable monitor monitor that is also of great value price point for uh, pretty much everybody's budget and I'm going to go ahead and open this now all right so this is what you're getting here's your start guide how to use it user manual get a cool two-year warranty which is always great to have and another registration for a free replacement service Looks like I'm opening up like an Apple MacBook or an iPad. Really fantastic. Feels very premium. So here it is. Wow, absolutely gorgeous. And you get the actual cover with it, which is pretty amazing. I love that there's a lot of manuals just to let you know what to watch out for, how to take care of it, how to use it. Because a lot of products, these third-party products, it's hard to figure out a lot of different info on it. So they did a really amazing job giving all the info up front. Uh, absolutely looks premium. Here it is. That's absolutely gorgeous. It's uh, definitely pretty lightweight slightly bigger than a, a ipad pro but that feels incredibly light i can't wait to get this set up and show you guys here are the speaker grills on the side right there there's also some outputs headphone jack we got the power button and then yeah you can see how thin this is super thin but it feels so sturdy at the same time I definitely feel confident that I could take this and travel with this without worrying about it breaking easily when putting it in a book bag or a duffel bag. All right, so here's the other side. We got two, three more ports for HTV, HD, and it looks like Thunderbolt is there. Had to double check on that in there, and there's another speaker grill. Okay, so let me put that to the side. I'm already feeling like this is spending for what it's worth from Amazon, amazing value so far. But I love how they just organize all the cables, but you're getting USB to USB-C. There it is right there, HDMI, got your power outlet, nice, okay. I've been hearing that without the USB that the screen doesn't get as bright with or without it, we're gonna check on that. And then here is another one for the USB-C. So it's very sensible, I'm really excited to hook this up and get to work. And just to show you guys that this could be a great addition for you guys in your setup, regardless if you're an office worker, you're a business person, entrepreneur, if you're a musician, music producer, beat maker, videographer, video creator, content creator, whatever it is, this could be something you could definitely add into your studio that's very useful and helpful and could be a great gift idea for, you know, the holiday season. The screen is completely set up and it is absolutely gorgeous. It's not exactly like the MacBook Air but it's pretty much up there and it definitely serves its purpose. It hooks up right away when you plug it in via USB-C. I went ahead though and plugged in through HDMI as well right there with the power outlet as well. It does give it a little bit more vibrance, a little bit more brightness. It's not a huge difference. You'll have to decide for yourself when you get this monitor. So far, very impressed with what we're getting right out of the box. Easy to go ahead and drag and drop. It's gonna be very useful for opening up secondary documents or folders. There is a few tips I do wanna show you really quickly to help you guys get you set up, regardless if you already have this monitor or you plan on getting this as a gift for yourself or somebody else is on the side what took me a little bit of time is you'll see on the buttons there is the power button and then this is going to be the brightness button so up will increase the brightness and down but what gave me trouble is how to open up the menu so you actually have to push down on down on it to open the menu button and so from there you're going to toggle it up and down to change 
the settings. And this is the settings I'm using on my MacBook Air M2. And so far, what I've noticed, the best settings is going to what you see there, brightness at 100, contrast at 55. I, I just have it on standard. Some people say movie, you can play around with it to see what works for you. I dialed up the sharpness to four. I noticed that looked better. Okay, so just play around with it to see what fits your eye. And then there's actually a secondary point here, which I dragged the general settings, went down to display option right there. And you notice that I've got this MNN monitor, portable monitor set to the right and how to give it even more brightness. I haven't seen anybody talk about this or show this, but what you're going to do is you'll see here on the built-in display, because I'm using the MacBook Air M2, it's set on color LCD. But if you go to the screen on HDMI, it's set at HDMI, but here is the trick to increase brightness. So you're going to go to color LCD right here to match it. Watch this. Boom. So you get a little bit more crispiness and vibrance by setting to color LCD. Just a little bit of a booster there. It's not going to be anything huge, but you know, better. Definitely play around with that. That's going to be uh, a nice little boost right there. Overall, very satisfied with this monitor. It's very smooth. Definitely serves its purpose. Definitely worth the price. It goes anywhere in between like $80, $70 to $100, depending on the season and timing. It's definitely going to help me to open up folders on the side and documents and websites, just anything like that, images, pictures, whatnot, video. So definitely very worth it. I love this stand too that it comes with. It's exactly like a tablet, which is really cool. You can actually flip it and it'll close it and just take it with you. I haven't played around with the speakers with it because I'm using probably the best portable audio monitors that I've been using for almost five years, which are these iLoud monitors amazing i might have also a extra blog post just writing in a little bit more detail about this mnn portable monitor the link to the website the blog will be there if you feel like reading that to see if it's worth getting or not definitely worth it in my opinion so let me know if you have any questions have an amazing day thank you for watching